Good morning, gurus. Welcome to another episode. Yesterday was pretty bloody. I warned about it. Hopefully, you paid attention to my video. This was yesterday, 24 hours ago. Um, one day ago, so you can see this one that I've been warning about for a few weeks. Brought a rising wedge which breaks down. So, it's still breaking down and volume has. And I was giving a warning yesterday and that played out. Bitcoin broke down. And we've got a huge drop across the markets, very brutal on altcoins. And we're breaking down from this rising wedge that I talked about. And I've been warning about this for a few weeks, like I think almost one month now. Be very cautious. Even though Bitcoin didn't get hit that hard, alts got destroyed um, over on my portfolio. Portfolio on Bybit, you can see we got. I just got hammered yesterday. Sp I was down around 14 16 thousand dollars yesterday, which is not bad considering um, I, because I reduced my positions a lot before the drop. But you can see here MCRT was down 3.6 percent, um, Uniswap was down 13 percent. I should have closed more of Uniswap, that was the biggest loss actually. Pocket was down six percent, um, Dogecoin down six percent, Worldcoin down. 9% lucky I reduced Worldcoin. I should have reduced the other positions more. Um, Bitcoin just got hammered, touching 65,931. Um, funding fees go negative. My buyers are still set at 63k, 60k for five Bitcoin at 60,252. Bitcoin at 63k, Doge 11 cents, and I've got buyers on Doge at 12 cents. Now we're coming to 1360. Um, and I'm gonna buy what well, that'll be around ten thousand dollars worth of Doge right now. I have Let's see my holdings. Right now I have around 4% on Doge. So I've got around 25K. And if this order goes through, I'll have plus another 10K. So no, it's not much. But I gotta be cautious because Doge can come down more. The market is not looking good. Let's go into Bitcoin first. Um, going into Bitcoin. 67,000 dropping out of this rising wedge and the volume is still very very weak why i knew that it was going to drop and why i've been warning about going long on bitcoin here everyone tell me i'm wrong but the main reason is the volume this is on the weekly charts each of these volume candles represents one week and when you zoom in you can see that each of the weekly volumes has been massively dropping last week we had um, 500,000 Bitcoin traded. The week before, 480,000 Bitcoin traded. The week before, 640,000 traded. The week before, 640. The week before, 670. The week before, 1 million. So you can see that the volume now has cut in half. Um, and that's why I was very worried about going extremely long here and to be cautious. Crypto grew, but still blew by from February 2023. Still blew by now. But just, I was very warning about this. Hopefully you paid attention. Um, this rising wedge that broke down on Bitcoin, they usually play out like this, build pressure and drop down and come down to the base. So I've got two buyers to bounce on Bitcoin. One at 63,000. Uh, 62,969 stop loss 62,559 to try and catch a bounce on the drop and then i'm just going to close it on the bounce risk to reward 62 times every dollar risk 410 dollar risk to make twenty five thousand dollar gain with no leverage 10x level 250 thousand dollar gain so one of those trades is set there and one trade at 59 because those are big supports but i'm just going to only open these trades purely to catch the bounce and then sell them catch the bounce and then sell them because i can clearly see the yellow trend line that Bitcoin's been in all year, if it, if it pulls back to the yellow trend line, then that target would be 59K. So that's where I want to try and catch the bounce and then go heavy long. Till then, I would be very cautious. Um, big support is at 63K. And that's how I've got my trade set up on Bybit. Bitcoin at 63K, 2 Bitcoin, 5 Bitcoin at 60K. And Doge, I've got at 11 cents, I've got 500K Doge. Um, now I want to check out, so Doge, I've got buyers at 12 cents. Now I want to make sure my buys are going to be worth it and big enough and at the right times. I don't want to buy and then it just keeps dropping more. Um, like I actually and Doge played out like I said, unfortunately. Um, we had this big blue descending triangle that builds pressure, and I thought it would break out here, but I warned that most likely descending triangles break out 70% of the move, so it should be down here. So I was expecting us to roll over here, and I closed some of my Doge position in that anticipation, and unfortunately I was right. This this, this rising wedge played out. Um, broke down exactly as I predicted with the target being 12 cents. So a big bounce would be on this blue trend line. You can see, let's zoom out because I want to make sure. Big support, I would say, on Doge right now. The biggest support area is here. 10 cents. That's where you have a very big support on Doge. Um, 
10 6. Hmm. Biggest support is at 10 6 8 4. So I'm gonna, and I've got a buy order on Doge at 12 cents. Let's make it 11. At 11 cents, I'll buy 100,000 Doge, which is 10,000 Doge is. Wait. Hmm. Okay, let's buy. I'll buy 10,000 Doge at 11 cents. I'll buy. $15,000 worth of Doge at 11 cents to try and catch that. Let's actually, to catch the bounce, let's buy more. I'll buy $20,000 worth of Doge at 11 cents. Okay, Uniswap, $7.20. I've got those buyers. I closed some position of Uniswap, but I still hold. And that was where I took the biggest hit because it was a 13% drop. Yesterday was like a 10% drop. So from 12, 11, almost $12 down to $8.80. So nearly a 20% drop when I was still holding, I closed some of the position at 50K and I reduced it, but I was still holding 30K. So it's still a 6K drop, unfortunately. So Uniswap, let's see where I'm going to buy. BNB also massively dropped. It would have been nice to close out BNB in, um, in massive profits, but I think I can hold it till IPO. So um, on Uniswap, Big support, I would say, is coming up at here. $6.70. And right now I've got buyers on Uniswap at $7.20. But the support is at $6.80. So let's modify it. Um, to cancel. Uniswap $6.80. Let's also buy $20,000 worth at $6.80 to just catch a bounce. Okay, that's Uniswap. Um, pocket 27K, also down 7%. Pocket getting hammered. Let's see on the weekly charts. Now I'm just coming, what I'm doing is I'm just setting trades on very, very big supports now. That's what you can see I'm doing. So pocket big, big support isn't till here. I would say that's big support, eight cents. Could even go lower, I would say, even here, at seven seven, zero point zero zero seven seven on pocket. And I've got buy orders. I don't have buy orders for pocket. I'm holding too much actually. Okay, I just hold it as it is. But zero point if it drops that much, zero point zero seven seven, that's quite brutal. That's another thirty percent drop, so I'll lose if I'm currently holding. Um, I'm holding pocket 27k. Another 30% drop would be 7k if it was to drop to 0 0.007. Volumes, not volume, is getting weaker. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna close. I'm gonna close 50% and put buy orders at 0 0.007. So I'm gonna sell um, eleven thousand dollars worth of pockets. So I'm gonna put a sell order here for five thousand. So, and a sell order here for 5,000. So that's going to reduce my position in half. Then I'm going to put buy orders at 0 0.77. 0 0.077. And then I'm going to buy $15,000 worth. No. Oh, selling that 10,000. Yeah, I'll buy $15,000 worth at 0 0.007. $15,000 worth at 0 0.007. Done. Um, what else do I have here? I've got, so USD, Bitcoin, MCRT, Uni. I could reduce some of my Bitcoin in case, but it already took quite a dump. Now I want to just catch those leveraged longs. Would have been better to close it a few days ago, save that 4 or 5K there. But Pocket took the biggest hit, actually. Uni's top took the biggest hit. Doge, I've got more buy orders already set. And we're all dropping, but I reduced my positions before we're all dropped. Um, which is amazing because I closed it knowing that it would I saved a lot on that I had a big position of world and I closed it down Anticipating this drop so I have more cash to buy the dip. So world three dollars sixty Huge down since I sold it um, at five dollars etc around five dollars dropped massively Coming down to my yellow trend line big support two dollars ninety So I still have fourteen thousand dollars worth And I'll buy more world 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 
at three dollars yeah three dollars are by six thousand world that's my updates in the market be very cautious out there everyone i hope you took my warnings i've been warning for a lot under the video go down below sign up to bybit that's the exchange i use for trading you get a thirty thousand us dollar bonus when you meet their trading requirements being x is also good binance is good um take the crypto master course to learn all this join us in the telegram there's nine thousand of you i've been warning for a few weeks about this bitcoin altcoin drop and i literally sold the top on bitcoin and alts i'll show you on twitter by the by the ETF, and, and this we've held on this entire from time. March. Bitcoin this trade is one hundred and eighty-one thousand dollars in the profit. I twelve thousand dollars to one hundred and eighty-one thousand, and I close it in the profits. Everyone, I'm going to do a market order, uh, just a few dollars above where we are because we pump so much sometimes. Let's do a market order. I closing with one hundred and eighty thousand dollars profit. Close. I called that top. Um, back in March and the last few weeks I've also been giving danger since that top in March we are down across the board 50 to 70 percent on alts hit the subscribe button smash up thumbs up button turn on the bell you can watch me learn from me yes I have a beard yes I just woke up and my hair is messy it's up to you if you want to learn from a multi-millionaire love you all have an amazing day watch what I do if you're skeptical watch my videos four years I've been making these daily videos and I was you have to be very quick at the top to get out. Now, where I'm, what I'm worried, looking for is for strong supports, for a strong bounce to go long again. And it's coming close for a lot of altcoins. A lot of them got sold off very hard. Bitcoin, 58K. Love you all. Have an amazing day. And I'll see you all again tomorrow.